starting our main topic if you're interested in the source codes and more information about my videos you can check out the my blog codeloop.org in the video description so you can get all information and source codes from my all videos in this blog Hello friends, I am Parways and this is our 49th video in PyQt5 GUI development. So in the previous video we have learned uh, about creating uh, Q wizards in PyQt5. So this is from the previous video. Uh, in this video I am going to talk about creating Q file dialog in PyQt5. So first of all uh, I have created a new Python file and let me just copy my window code and paste it in here so this is the simple basic code for creating my window and let me change the title to pyqt 5 q file dialog okay now if I run this uh, you'll see that I have a window so I don't want to run this okay uh, now uh, for creating Q file dialog, uh, let me. Uh, okay, so I need first of all I need some imports, and let me um, let me just change this to uh, Q dialog. Uh, I need a, a Q push button. So also I need a Q label like this, and uh, I need a Q file. Uh, dialog okay now let me just change this to Q dialog okay now uh, in the init UI I'm going to create oh sorry I have forgot to add a QV box layout QV box layout okay now in here so let me create just a view box layout V box Q vbox layout <coughs> and uh, I want to uh, create a push button so cell dot btn uh, q push button and let me give the text open or browse image we can call a uh, browse uh, image okay and uh, let me just uh, add so this to the vbox layout so vbox dot add widget and I want to add my button also set your layout so cell dot set layout to the vbox layout okay and before this let me also create a label so cell dot label q label because uh, in this uh, example uh, I want to show you that how you can browse an image and uh, uh, open that image in your window so you can do the, uh, uh, do this with text uh, the process is the same but uh, I want to show you that how you can do with image so let me just for right now give an hello text this is a test text and we will remove this so add this to our viewbox layout and I want to add my label okay so uh, if I run this uh, you will see that I have a push button and also uh, with a label so you can see this is a push button with a label okay now uh, we are going to create our uh, dialog so I want to create uh, in here a method so I call it get image or you can call it browse image browse image uh, let me create a variable of f name and I want to get uh, qfile dialog dot uh, uh, you can see that you have get save file name uh, when you're going to save a file because we're going to open a file we need this uh, sorry get open file name dot get open file name okay uh, now it needs some parameters the first one is self the parent 
and the second one is uh, we can give it open file and the third one is uh, the drive the default drive that you want so I want the default C and C drive like this uh, the last uh, one parameter is uh, that we are going to filter our browsing so I want uh, image files and it should be <coughs> uh, dot gpg images and all uh, uh, gpg images and also all gif uh, images or you can uh, whatever you want I want gif or you can choose png images there is no problem and uh, okay uh, after this uh, now we are going to create a variable of image path and uh, I want to get the uh, first one the first one image path and now I want to create a text text map object so we need to import this uh, from pyqt5 dot qt GUI import q map okay now uh, we need to create a pixmap pex object so pixmap uh, q pex map and uh, we need to add our image path in the pixmap and we need to set this image to our label so self dot label uh, set pixmap q pex map and in here you need to add the pex map in here also you can resize so cell dot resize uh, cell uh, dot yeah cell dot resize pex map dot width and pex map dot height <coughs> okay now we have created our this browse image button we need to connect this and to our button so self dot btn dot uh, clicked dot connect and I want to connect my browse image with the clicked signal so browse uh, image <coughs> Okay, now this is our complete code. Let me just uh, run my application. So, okay, now if I click on, uh, so let me just uh, first remove this hello from this text because I don't want to add any text in here. <coughs> okay, now if I click on browse image and uh, if I choose an image for example uh, you can choose <coughs> so let me just choose this uh, image and if I click on OK so now you can see we have browsed this image successfully and you can do uh, open more images if you want so let me check that uh, if I have any more uh, GPG images so let me just open this icons <coughs> let me choose this bg now you can see we have uh, this in here so like this you can browse an image and you can uh, do uh, browsing like this uh, i will add the source code to the video, video description if you have any question uh, please let me know for the further videos subscribe to my channel and also share the videos